Hello, he's GP. He's Dr. Brain. And this is Magic Science. Ready for some magic that's gonna blow you away, GP? Um, yeah, Dr. Brain. Good. Now, what I've done here, I put a little balloon inside this bottle. And my challenge to you is to see if you can blow it up. Of course I can blow it up, Dr. Brain. All it involves is breathing, and I'm really good at breathing. Now, apply it. <sighs> go on, son, have a blow. That's it. Go on, go on. Blow hard, blow hard, blow hard. That's it. Ooh. <laughs> have you got any breath left? <gasps> All right. So, you know why it didn't work? Is it because I don't have magic, Dr. Brain? Yes. You haven't got magic. Want to see me do it? I'd like to see you try, Dr. Brain. <laughs> Power up, lungs! Wow! Look at that, pretty good, eh? That's amazing! Ah, now watch this! Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> Told you I'd blow him away! But was it magic or just magic science? <laughs> Wanna know how you can blow your friends away with this incredible trick? Earlier, I carefully pierced a small hole in the plastic bottle. And this is the key to the trick. Get a grown-up to help. It's tricky. When GP tried to blow up his balloon, there's nowhere for the air in the bottle to escape, so it's nearly impossible to blow it up. But my bottle had a hole to let the air out, so it was easy to blow up. Then I covered the hole with my finger to create a vacuum, which kept the balloon inflated. To deflate the balloon, I just took my finger off to release the air. Guinea pig, you all right? How far did you get? I ended up all the way in Papua New Guinea. He's not my real dad. Papa, Guinea. Oh, I get it! <laughs> See you next time for more magic science.